Hello everyone and thank you for joining us on This Week in Erie. As you can tell, we're on the road and we are here at the Erie Zoo with the zoo guy, Scott Mitchell. Scott, thanks for joining Absolutely. us. Absolutely, glad to be here. So um, you can tell fall is in the air and the decorations looking a little spooky, not too scary Not though. too scary, that's um, right. Yeah. So it's time to start thinking about Zubu, but Zubu is gonna have a little different look this year. Uh, Tell us uh, the first big change you had to make for Zubu. Well, we had to eliminate trick-or-treating as the people were, they would go to booths around the grounds. And there's a couple of different reasons. One, the health department wasn't really excited about us individually handing mm -hmm. candy to young children. But another function of that was um, volunteers. Uh, last year we had oodles and oodles of high school volunteers that required service hours. Well, as the high schools have eliminated those service hours, mm -hmm. that pool of volunteers dried up. Last year it was over 400 high school students volunteered at Zubu. So those two things together really kind of make, made us take a really hard look at that. And so we eliminated what was the traditional trick-or-treating style. So instead, and also buying tickets too, uh, in terms of you're encouraging the online sales? Yeah, that's the only way at the moment you can buy them. Oh, you, so there's no other option. Right. Well, okay. you can call and okay. we can get them ready for you. Or you could stop at the office. Uh, the office isn't really open, but we do answer the door. Right. And so you could... Um, you could buy the tickets that way, but we really encourage you to do it online at eriezoo.org. It's real simple. Um, and they're timed tickets, just like the zoo tickets. Right, because obviously part of Zubu is you walk through, you come down this big hill, you go to each station, but you're gonna try to space that out so you don't have the long line. Correct, yeah. And so we'll have um, only so many people for every 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. And uh, so that you really want to buy tickets in advance because if there's a specific day and time that you wanna come, you need to need to get because you have a soon. limit. We do. We right. have a limit that we're um, we can have in the park, but and again, any given time uh -huh. as well. And we're not full yet, um, but it is filling pretty quickly. Mm -hmm. So if there's specific again day and time that you want, I'd recommend going on now. And tickets are um, uh, ten dollars for um, non-members and seven dollars for members. Okay. Uh, and you know, um, we've tried to do some other things. So for example, the trick or treating the kids are still going to get their bag of treats. Mm -hmm. So we're going to prepackage them. It'll be the same number of treats that they've gotten in the past. Uh -huh. They'll just get them all at the end. Oh, okay. And so we'll have a, a spooky scavenger hunt and we'll have a lot of the other things that you would expect at Zubu will still be going on. The train? The train will, okay. be, uh, will be running. And Thank this year, goodness. <laughs> yeah, we did something different. We did an eerie strong promotion okay. and we worked with other not-for-profits mm -hmm. and we provided them with a, a, a board basically and they could decorate it however they wanted to and you represent see that on the train right? as you go on the train so oh, that's nice non nonprofits helping nonprofits is a great way and you know it's it's um good for them for the exposure that they get for the people that are here so also too so basically i mean when the kids my kids used to come and it was little the coolest part was being at the zoo at night yeah um so they're still going to have that experience it's just going to be a little more spread out but you have expanded your hours too we have we've, we've uh, we, we're not open on monday tuesdays and wednesdays any but this mm -hmm. at least this time so it's thursday through sunday um, and the last ticket, the time you can come in is eight o'clock, but they're open till nine. Mm -hmm. um, but on weekends, we're open noon to, to nine. Okay. Again, so you can, uh, uh, last time to come in is eight. And we've done that in the past to some degree, and it's been really, really successful, mm -hmm. particularly with people with little, little, little kids. Little ones, right. Because they want to be in bed at seven o'clock, and they don't necessarily want to be out at night. Uh -huh. So it's a really great way for families to be able to come and enjoy Zubu. And, and do it in a little bit different environment. And it, it does help us spread the crowds out on the weekends. Now, what about tickets for the train or the carousel? Do you buy those online you too? You can buy them online or you can buy them here okay. at the zoo, whichever is more convenient. Uh, and, you know, the train is such an important part of it and people do love the carousel. Um, but there are some of the other things we're gonna be able to keep as mm -hmm. well. Mm -hmm. We will still have the troll okay. at the troll bridge. You know, he'll be socially distant. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, we'll still have the talking pumpkin we're gonna, again, we'll do a spooky scavenger hunt. We'll do some other things to try to make up for the lack of trick-or-treating. Mm -hmm. But uh, sometimes it's just kind of cool to see the animals here at night. Well, and I mean, really, it's like as long as the kids get the candy at the end, that's all they need. <laughs> you know, for some parents, it's better that way because they're not all sugared up as they go exactly. through the Exactly. You don't have to wait in all the lines. <laughs> that's right. So, uh, that's right. Scott, when does Zubu start and where can our viewers uh, get a ticket? It'll start a week from th Thursday, the 14th, um, eriezoo.org. Again, it's Thursdays through Sundays. Mm -hmm. uh, and so it'll be... Uh, four days uh, next week, four days the following week, and then just Thursday and Friday, the, the 29th and 30th, will be our last two days. So I uh, really recommend getting online now and okay. uh, get your tickets. Great. Uh, that'll do it for this week in Erie. We're going to go and check out the baby pandas because I haven't seen those yet. So I'm sure that's a big draw. <laughs> you bet. Too. You <laughs> bet. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us. And don't forget, Zubu starts October 14th.